Hello, everyone. This is Sandy Britton with RBC Live. I want to welcome you to the call for the week of December 17th. Wow. It's that time of the year. And as even as we get started, I just want to wish everyone a very Merry Christmas. And it's, it's just so much fun to be around um, friends, family, and acquaintances, and of course, all of those holiday parties that we're going to. And that brings us to our seven-day reset program. Now, with me on the call today is uh, Mr. Ron Zare from Canada. And Ron, you've had a very important role in getting this program launched. And of course, you're our star on the video. And, and if you're listening to this call and you have not had a chance to, to watch what I'm talking about, I want to encourage you to go to checkoutrbc.com and you're going to be able to see a video uh, less than 10 minutes that will explain to you what the seven-day reset program is. But Ron, we are having a people all across North America signing people up and getting them started on a seven-day reset. And what kind of impact do you think that's having in their lives? Sandy, thanks for having me on the call. And hello, everyone, and Merry Christmas to you all. It's, it's having a great impact. And, you know, as we were looking at the benefits a month or a couple months ago, as we were looking at the benefits that people are having with the seven day reset, we just thought, you know, why would people just wait and why wait till January start on it right now? And so that's where the campaign to really push the seven day reset here leading up in the weeks to Christmas and, and Christmas, this holiday season can be such a stressful time. It can be a time where people are under pressure. They're not eating well. They're putting such a load on their bodies. And so why not help people to make just a little shift? We're not talking about, you know, embarking on a, a full scale change your life kind of diet program or something. But instead, we're talking about making some shifts through just a seven day window is really all that it takes to have a big difference. And, and Dr. Carolyn put this program together to really reset the body. And yes, a lot of people do it to lose weight, but it's not just about losing weight. It's about resetting the body. And what better time to do that than leading up to and during the Christmas season? That is so true, Ron. And, you know, when you're talking about resetting your body, for me, it's been... Uh, you know, I have a tendency to have a little bit of a sweet tooth, and we have sweets everywhere. Everywhere we go, people are offering us a little little treats that all have to happen to be sugar-based. And, you know, when you're talking about resetting and helping yourself to balance your sugars, for your long-term health, that is so critical. But I think the part that I get most excited about is people that I bump into are exhausted. They are tired. They're going and, as they say, burning the candle at both ends. And what this does to boost your energy and help to get your, keep your mood balanced and, of course, your hormones balanced is such a critical part of, of the program that, oh, my goodness, I think that I've added a couple products to our daily intake that we'll be taking forever simply because we realize how important it is to keep our system balanced at all times. But... I absolutely love the way this group of products has helped me, has helped Ron, and almost <laughs> literally everyone I talk to that will commit to the seven-day result gets results. It, it really, it really does happen that way. And and the other great thing is it's it's an easy program to share. And uh, for anyone who's not familiar with it, there's invitation cards. Get in touch with us. We can get you some invitation cards. Or just send people to that website ad address, checkoutrbc.com slash why wait. And wait is spelled like pounds weight, okay? So W-E-I-G-H-T. That's checkoutrbc.com slash why wait. Send people there. There's a video that explains everything to them, and then they can get back to you, and you can help them get set up. And, and of course, stress again that it's a seven-day program. And so it's a great, great an easy way to share and to help people. And you say, well, you know what? It's almost Christmas. If they'd order it now, would they get the product in time to do it before, you know, the 25th of December? Maybe, maybe not. But even if they start it right after, it's still a phenomenal program. It's still a great thing to do. And so we just want to really encourage people to share it. 
I'm um, get it out there, help your people get introduced. What a phenomenal way to experience RBC Life products and to really have a, as Sandy, as you were saying, really have a product experience in less than seven days. And Ron, you know that why wait? If you if you're saying like I need to wait till after the holidays, that why wait? It's not going to work unless you have the product in your hand the minute uh, that first week starts after the holidays. So please, like you said, it's a great time to get the product and take advantage of it. We still have time to take advantage of it before the holidays and get our body in tip-top shape before we start our little bit of that overeating that occurs during the uh, Christmas to New Year week. You know, in addition to that, Ron, you know, that's kind of the starting point. I think one of the most important things that I want to uh, give as a reminder to all of our people out there is that the importance of follow-up. So it's, it's so critical that when somebody gets someone started that they do a little bit of follow-up so that that person, number one, understands the program and what to do next. But how important is, is that follow-up on when you do bring someone new, you introduce them to the seven-day reset, how important is follow-up? It is so critical to follow up and to do it regularly. You know, I like house plants, and Lois, my wife, gets on me because I water them occasionally. But if I water my plants and then I wait two months and I water them again, and then I wait until they're drooping and, and you know, all getting brown around the edges, and then I throw some water at them again, they're not going to be healthy and vibrant. And really with the people that we um, that we help to launch on the seven-day reset, uh, we're, we're giving them a gift. We're giving them something that is powerful, that will do so much for their body. But if we don't follow up, we're kind of leaving them there. We're just kind of leaving them hanging and, and leaving them to kind of dry and wither and turn brown around the edges, if you will. Mm -hmm. But but here's here's the thing. I mean, so to do that follow up, I mean, four days into it, make that phone call. How's it going? Are you taking the stuff? Because we know that it doesn't do any good on the shelf. You have to put it into your body. And and so are you taking it? Are you taking it? Are you taking it regularly? Are you taking it? Are you following the system? To ask those questions and then to help them take the next step. And Sandy, you know, we've seen through the years, people who consistently take that next step are, those are the people that get not just the best results, but they, they extend those results. They um, continue the results. They continue to improve and they become loyal customers and consumers of RBC Life products and continue to benefit from RBC Life products. So, so to make that phone call to ask those key follow-up questions. So how's it going? Do you want to continue? Would you like to lose more weight if that's one of the primary motivating factors? Would you like to maintain what you're doing? Are you not so sure what the next step is? Well, that's where the PNP comes in. So there's, there's some critical questions that pe people can ask that we can ask to help people take the next step. And also, Ron, you know, when you're doing that, it's real important that you let your new person, your, your new uh, customer, know that you're going to be giving them a call back. So nail down a specific time and say, gosh, you know, well, I'll get this order in for you today. I'll give you a call in four days. Would that be okay? What time works better for you, morning or evening? So, and in addition to that, if you say you're going to do something, use your calendar and write it down. So don't trust that I'm going to remember to call somebody back on Friday morning. Uh, I'm, I'm a busy person too, and I could get, just like you said, I could forget to water those plants. So write it down and set yourself a reminder that you're going to call someone back. And you might even want to give that person a little email and, and send it out to them and say, hey, I look forward to talking to you on Friday morning. So that, so that not only do you have a reminder, but according to that phone conversation that you had with that person, you've given the new person, your new customer, a reminder as well. So in that process of taking them to the next step, make sure that you nail down a time, nail down a date, and write it down somewhere so that you have uh, your little reminder to make sure that no matter how busy you are, especially this time of the year, that you're following up with your brand new person. Now, this really is not even for just brand new people. You need to use this technique with everyone on your team. All of your 
downline team members that are buying product, sometimes they need to have that little phone call. So, Ron, I know that we're talking about the seven-day reset, but that, as the saying goes, the fortune is in the follow-up. People want to know how much you care, not always how much you know. So by giving them that little phone call, <clears throat> saying thank you this time of the year, uh, you're going to have, uh, you're going to be stepping forward by leaps and bounds and reaching out and contacting your customers and making sure that they feel that they have closure in their decision. I'm using this product. Are you happy with this product? Are the seven day reset is working this way. What questions do you have about the seven day reset that I might be able to help you with? Oh, yes, we've had several people that have had that issue, you know, or had that result. And so we want to give people an opportunity to develop relationships because relationships is what our industry is all about. And, and Sandy, those are the very words that were in my mind, relationship and caring. And, you know, people need to know that we care about them. And that's really what that follow-up call is. That's really what, as you said, not just the new customer, but those people who have been with us for a long time. And, and what a great time to just connect with them. And, and even right now, I know it's busy and all of that stuff, but to give them that call and say, hey, this is a courtesy call. I want you to know, really appreciate your business. Is there anything I can help you with? Have you heard about the seven-day reset? Have you heard about the new formulation of Vitalo, which, by the way, be sure you're uh, aware of that and the added Ace Manon in there. But just to let them know that you care. I, I had the experience one time, and I'll, you know, I'll confess it right here. I had the experience once of phoning someone that I had not had contact with a long, for a long time. And when I phoned them and we, we talked a little bit, what they said to me was, Ron, I didn't think you cared anymore. And it was like, oh, what a stab in the heart, right? Because people want to know that you care about the, their business is important to you, that you care about their success. And that really is the heart of our business. And when we, when we hear the stories about how much being a part of RBC Life, being a part of the RBC Life family has meant to people, not just with their health, but also with their personal development and their relationships and with that extra money that they've been able to earn, we know that, hey, this is something that it is a business that changes people's lives and our caring for people is really the fuel that makes that happen. Well, Ron, that is so well put. I can't think of any better note to to close on that and to say thank you so much for caring so much about the people that you have on your team. And I know each and every team member knows how much you care and how much Lois cares and how much we appreciate your caring heart. I also want to encourage everyone that if you haven't had an opportunity to buy one of the holiday specials, uh, that they are available in the back office. They will only be available till the end of the month. So please take advantage of the holiday specials. And we look forward to talking to each and every person. But I want to remind everyone that next Thursday is Christmas Eve. We will have a recorded call, but it won't be coming. It might be coming out of a little delay. So again, I just want to say thank you, Ron, for joining us today and I look forward to talking to each and every person before the end of the year. Go out and make it a great holiday and Merry Christmas to everyone. Thank you, Sandy, and thank you for how much you care and, and how much you and Ron give to um, support the team and support your team members and, and the field as well. And yes, Merry Christmas, everyone. Um, all the best wishes for a happy holidays to you.